Hello guys, welcome back to another different tier Silveira. My name is Jimmy Shreds and we're back with another episode of Beginner's Guide Project Zero New Beginning. As always, I'm gonna be explaining stuff while I'm playing the game. I have quite many hours in this game and I'm just gonna share what I know while still ex still uh, um, experience, exper oh my god. Uh, well, anyways, I'm gonna experience what you guys experiencing uh, as a new players, but I have a lot of knowledge and I'll apply that knowledge to the game. So, we have left off for level 6, we have a Lunar event currently, so we're gonna make use of that, because we're gonna, you know, level faster, progress faster, which is, you know, really good thing. I highly advise you all to take part in this Lunar event if you can, because there are some good missions and purple zones and really good items that you can craft, especially as new players. But I'm not gonna keep it too long, I'm gonna start, let's get it, I'm gonna play some music. Here we go. Okay, where we left off. Alright. So we're gonna go straight for these missions. Uh, okay, this is what we have. Just checking. I'll lower the music a bit. Fine. All right. So we got these missions at the place called Family Residence, which is located right here. There are two missions that we can do. They're really cheap to do. I hope antibiotics are not expensive. And do we have any in the stash? I have one. Okay. Bye. -bye. So we're gonna bring. Some antibiotics we need three antibiotics for today's mission and we need some we need some 0.35 ammo which i don't think we have yeah we do not have we'll buy some i need like two bullets and which is lowest no i guess this one will do i'm gonna get that i'm gonna go head there straight to that place because we're gonna get a lot of experience from that. We currently have, because of the uh, <clears throat> lunar event, 50% search speed, 100% find delete, unique, and 100% XP gain. So we are currently at much XP, 118%. All right. Guess we sold some things. There you go. All right. Let's head to the location. We're gonna do that first and then we're gonna be doing some purple zones to get those red envelopes there we go we have it here should we go for there first hmm this one is gonna be hard uh uh let's go to the family residence first guys and let's kill these guys for xp hell yeah which is he gonna give us okay damn that's that's a good Good amount of XP, holy moly. Give me that. Take that. Oh yeah, look, they're spawning. Okay. Ah, uh, maybe I should use... Uh, we can move faster. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. I should. All right. So, for those of you who do not know, we're going for the pistol build. We currently do not have... Actually, you know what? We're gonna see, actually, because of those new items that we craft. We might go a little different path. But, yeah, we don't have a pistol expert. So, we shall see how we're gonna go. Like, in which weapon we're gonna spec. But, so far, I've, I was thinking probably pistols. Because, you know, they're the... Most new friendly weapon currently. Because uh, we can craft SMG, shotgun and rifle. And rifle and the shotgun seem really good. I'll probably try to craft uh, rifle and uh, shotgun. I'll skip SMG because SMG is... Uh, it's quite... Uh, it's quite costly to maintain. So yeah. Now, let's see what do we get here. Take that. And here we go. 
Look at look at this amount of XP, guys. 90k. How many levels do we get? Wait, wait, wait. We are level six. What are you after? Oh my god, guys, we're level 14. And this guy. Yeah. 82k. We're gonna get to level 17, guys. That's insane. That's insane, dude. Alright, so the next thing what we want to do uh one level sprinter to max as high as possible which is level four then the next thing we're gonna go for because we want to get to level 50 as fast as possible i'm gonna go for the fast learner wait am i blind oh there we go okay we're gonna go put four points into that will help us a ton with leveling okay next thing we're gonna put points into is i definitely will go for hmm, accurate are we currently uh, i mean that's accurate still that's fine i'll go one point into marksman one more there you go for now, that should be fine. We should be more than accurate. And that, the range is 32.5 meters, so that's fine. I'll take that. And the base range is 25. Yeah, I'll take that. Okay, next, we're going to go into... Let's see. We can go reloading, quick shot. Point into reloading, definitely. One more. And now, I'm going to put two points into the headshot. Is headhunter. There you go. And now we have to. We have thirty envelopes. We're gonna go for that purple zone. I hope we'll, we'll manage to fight that. Fingers crossed. Hey, okay. here we are. This one is probably gonna be harder because it's level 15, but level 10 should be easy. And as always, if you have any questions, please do not hesitate. Ask down in the comments below, guys. Requests, you have feedback, anything, guys. Okay. Nice. How much XP do we get? We get 1.2 and we get 4k from here. Okay. So we're gonna do a bit of everything i think today no the most important thing is to have fun enjoy the game enjoy the process while you're doing levels and everything got him here comes the other one so we get we're at 563 So he gives us like uh, almost 500, like 400 uh, XP, something like that. That's, that's good, man. Right, here we are. Let's see how hard is this is gonna be. I killed 10 of these, huh? Okay, yeah. It's definitely not gonna be easy. Because our gear is for like level 5, but we'll try to pull it off. Definitely need to use a better pistol. Oh man. The 
Just keep moving when you're shooting. Make sure you, you do the proper spacing. And you can delag the kid zombies if you want. Okay. I'll delag her as well. Thing is, they're not very fast, so it's good for us. Hello, 15 is probably gonna be an issue. Because there is 20 of them. We're already struggling with these in terms of damage wise. Okay, well, it just leveled up. Moving. You like this guy? the lagging all these guys that are not uh, neon zombies just delay them it's very important cause you can use them to block other zombies watch that okay, i cannot show you on this guy but you see that he was kind of blocked couldn't pass that way and there we go got them all Right, let's see. Can we can we do this one? Fingers crossed. Uh, we have one skill point which we're gonna put into the be confident into marksman. Uh, there we go. Like especially if we're gonna switch to some other weapon, the marksman is gonna help us a lot because the accuracy maximum minimum and aim speed and also range okay thousand so we need 22k more for level up okay we shall see how fast are these guys gonna be where we're going if they're gonna be too fast uh, we're most likely gonna get back any envelopes do we get good uh, we get 10. Hmm. Okay, we're definitely doing gear upgrade when you get uh, back. Most likely the first thing we're going to go for is like... Uh, boots or legs actually. We're actually going to go first for the legs I think. Definitely. Because the weapon we can buy off the market. Okay, let's see how fast they are. And these guys are on fire. Okay, we gotta delag as many of these so we do not have too many to spawn. Yeah, they they are mutated. I mean, uh, sorry. Yeah, they they're not mutated. They have the uh, oh oh my god. They're like bloody, so they they have more HP and deal more damage. Because they are higher level zombies. Be hard. They're still infected, but they have mutation. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. The lag. Got it. Okay, we just have three for now. It's fine. And with delagging purple in purple zones, you can control the waves, like, because there is a certain amount of enemies that can spawn. So, you know, by delagging, we are controlling how many can spawn. So that helps us a ton. And there's one. Okay, get him. Got it. Comes another one. Always try to focus on one target. What I did is not a good idea. I killed this guy first. Yes. Okay, got another one spawned. 
just killed five we have four more minutes we might not make it but i'll try my best because we do not have enough damage yeah it's gonna be hard use this okay Like, if you're gonna focus, like, don't go more than two targets. No more than two different targets. Come on, guys, these go right this way. Yes. Come on. Got him. Well, oof. This is gonna be hard. I guess we're getting a bunch of XP. It's worth it. Oh, this way. This one. Or the green one. It was the one, I think. Oh no, we got out of the zone. Ah, oh, that didn't count. Ah, oh, we we're not gonna make it. Three minutes to kill, 10, 11 more. I don't know. Literally, cannot miss a single shot. This one is green, which means 20% more HP. We got him. I don't have enough attack speed. Comes another one. Green again. Ah. Luck. One. We have enough walk speed. Oh my god. Don't let me down, game. Seven more, come on. He's green again. Yes, yeah, he's gonna be so close. Dodge that. Come on, we got this. We got this. Let's go. This one. Oh man, they gotta be green. But of all variations, we got irradiated once. More HP. We should be able to pull it off. Okay. Three more, guys. Two more. We got this. We got this. Let's go. Yes. One more. Which one is it? I believe this one. Yes. Got it. Let's go. GG. Warm. Kill these for XP. We are. Damn, okay. We leveled up. I didn't even realize. Thank you, XP. And 2.7k cash. I'll take that. Got him. And where is this guy? Look at that. He's blocked by the zombies. Kill these guys, get XP as well. I 
these these kids can be quite uh, dangerous. Child zombies are a big no no to fight. Uh, okay, we can go for another shot into. Hmm. Guess we're gonna go reloading. So it looks to me, yeah, definitely. Okay, it's the reload time. It time to go back to the elbow, and we have another one. It matters, and we have another. We can get another ten there. These are too hard. I'm not gonna even bother with those. Let's see, we got how many do we need to craft an item? Let's go back and figure that out. But anyways, if there was no lunar event, how would I do this? Is I would be going for uh, missions. I'll be looting like the same thing that I'm that I'm doing right now. This is just like faster progress because of the lunar event. That's pretty much how it is. I will be doing the same things as I'm right now. And I, as I said, I highly advise you all to make use of this uh, event because. It's really good. And those missions that you've seen, guys, uh, every day they reset. The missions that I did at Family Residence. Where, you know, it's, it's located here. Below the elbow. Wait, my bad. Located uh, here. This one. Uh, so those two missions, like, there is five NPCs. And each NPC is, like, they're, they always ask uh, for some type of food, for some type of a drink, for, or for some type of uh, crafting material some type of ammo and some type of a medical item but these items uh can be uh different every day it's that's a catch so just because it was antibiotics and uh, that ammo for me today doesn't mean it's gonna be the same thing tomorrow for you guys you're gonna do so you know the most important thing is once you get to like level 20 25 that's that's it your progress is much faster in the game because now we can literally go to haverbrook like i don't have to stay here anymore but we're gonna go do the uh gonna go do the uh purple zone first gotta see if we can craft something already we need to make some cash for sure all right we're here just crossed. We have 23k. Damn, that's a lot. So the... Uh, what? Oh, what the heck? Where did I, where did I go? Man. <laughs> where did I go? Man, I'm... I'm, uh, I'm zoned out. Uh. <laughs> Alright, let's see. <coughs> what do we have in the car? Okay, the car is not looking good. Any fuel? Oh, damn. That's really bad. Alright, fingers crossed that we have enough to craft something. Uh, workbench. There we go. Okay, and... 65, 65. They're all 65. Oh man, we're missing some. Just a little bit. And look at those gloves. Oh... No, we must grab those. We definitely must grab that. Oh, we need that. We really need that, guys. Look at look at what I'm saying. So you have this SMG. Like, don't get me wrong. This SMG is it's it's good. Like, it has insane clip size, but the ammo, like, I'm not sure what's the price right now. It's like you see that it's like one K per box and a little over one K. And that's uh yeah. Well, you have twenty gauge, okay. Like, look at, it says, so you have you have 4.2 base headshot and 2.1 body damage. But look at the shotgun, 16 headshot base, 8 body damage. 20 gauge is around, okay there guys, 500. And rifle is 10.5 headshot and 3 body, which is still fine. And it's using 5.56, it's 5.56 is going for... Yeah, that's cheap. So maybe, maybe, oof, man, that's hard to decide. I would definitely try to craft all three of these if if I'll manage to. But we first need to focus on one weapon to craft these. Okay, let's get that. 
to go do the purple zone as fast as possible. Uh, chance you're dead. Chance you're dead. Dead, and let's move. Okay. Right. Oof. And uh, not that close. Right, after this, we are definitely moving to uh, to the to the Haverbrook. We have fourteen minutes till next purple zone rotation. Uh, use that. So, what I want to say, you want to stack up as much as experience as possible when you're leveling. Like, a lot of people are worried about cash. And, you know, my advice for all of you is to not worry about cash much. Worry about that you have enough cash to get through the levels, to get to level 50. Then you'll see how easy it is to make cash, guys. You'll, you'll see, like, once we get to level 50, like, I'll show you guys how easy it is to make cash. Like, looting. You just, like, you can do looting. You can do missions. You can do some purple zones. Doing some purple zones solo is not worth it, but there are some that are worth it, so it really depends. We'll get through everything. Just gotta get those levels. Okay, thank you already. Five, nine, six. Damn, that's a good XP, man. I really cannot uh, pass on that, but I get that. Alright. So, what is. Okay, it's unique and delete. Okay. I was hoping maybe for uh, find ammo, but it's fine. One idea. Huh? Uh, okay, ten. So repeat the same thing. Do you like this? Okay. There's already quite many. Holy moly! We need to we need to upgrade our primary weapon ASAP. And yeah, these guys they're uh, specially infected. So when you're killing these neon zombies, you need damage versus infected. Oh, we got out. Oof, my bad. You need damage versus infected and headshot damage. Or if you're using like if you're going for body damage, you go body damage and damage versus infected. The lag. Oh my god, they can't hit. Yeah, that was weird. I want more zombies. Oh, that's a hit. Got it. You're really safe for now. this guy I'm more spawning okay nice I'll take that they're literally missing I think five no ten to craft we're missing ten we need another ten to craft okay Definitely heading back and going straight to the Haver Brook. Yeah, let's move. Let's 
soon as we get to the heavy brook we're gonna do the um uh, the gear upgrade there for sure 10 minutes till the uh other purples on rotation but i think it's gonna be outpost attack yeah it's gonna be outpost attack which we're not gonna do because it's quite late where i'm at so we'll do the gear upgrade we'll see what we can get there and do and and we're most likely then gonna end the episode i don't want it to be too long for you guys as well Love to buy some gas first. So yeah. Oh yeah, that's that's good. That's good cash. I mean it's not much, it's like one one K, but hey, better than nothing. Need to upgrade the car parts as well so we do not spend too much fuel, which we can do. much does he sell for yep 1k as i said how much does bandaid sell well, it's actually not bad so 250 per one okay all right just checking <coughs> one of them Okay, no, we're missing 15. Okay. My bad. Some water here. Oh, they do not stack up. Nope. I attempt to get some fuel. Yeah, it's actually not that expensive. We'll buy these, it's fine. I need to buy some car parts. Uh vehicle. Second of uh, oh, max level is 19. Yeah, okay, doesn't matter which grade we can just go superior, that's gonna be fine. Uh, we need mouse per gallon and we need inventory. <laughs> it is the only thing we were able to find, really. And okay. And to 19. Take that. And 26,000. Sure that I want to pay that much. This will do for now. A five. So we got that already. And these things are expensive. Twelve, nine. Just for the start, anything will do. We'll be fine. And we'll go for this one. some kind of exhaust which will do i think we got everything let's move still have a little over 20k left okay manage it is it gonna work like that awesome There you go, that's much better. If you and it's time to head to the Haverbrook, there we go. 
I take the missions actually. No, we're not gonna take the missions. It's gonna take too long. Uh, four minutes still the outpost attack. Yeah, what can we do? Let's grab some of these items. Uh, there we go. Grab these. 84. Ah, not much. I'll take that. Yeah, now. Let's see. You can get better pistol for sure. Weapon. I'm level 15. Okay. Let's level 9. What can we get from the pistol? Headshot. Mm, I don't want to use that, and some of these things are way too expensive. This Python ain't bad. 1000. Uh, I think that's a steal, dude. I'll take that for now. Yep, we'll take that for now. What else can we find? Rifle. There's a bunch of rifles. 762 is not very cheap. So, so, so. I'd rather go with the good scout. And this seems like a good scout for now. Okay, and what can we get from shotgun? I'm gonna get some. Just like that. Ooh, look at that, dude. Yo. Don't, don't want to use 12 gauge for sure. This is... What about this one? It's good stats, but clip size. Like, look at this one, guys. There you go. Got ourselves some good items. I'm gonna still uh, use the pistol for now. Use these. Um, store some. ECP if we'll need in the future for now. For that. Oh man. This Python is really good. It's gonna do what we need. Hi. Buy some 3.5. Should do. And what can we upgrade? You can definitely get a better hat. Hmm, do we touch any of these for now? Because we're going to get from the items that we're going to craft. Is there a point to spend? No. Actually, just getting a possible hat. A cheap. Okay, max level 19. Let's see. You can get XP as well. Hmm, nope. Just XP is very expensive. Yeah, I'm not gonna even think about that. I mean, 2k is not much. No headshot. He's infected. This one seems cool. Headshot, maximum accuracy, any speed. I think I'm actually gonna go this one. Yeah, that. Do we need hands? Let's see. You get with XP. Yeah, I'm dreaming. Oof, man, that's so expensive. Mutated headshot surprise damage, that's not bad. It's a mutated find rare. 
For 800. Yo, I think we're buying that. Try mutated noise radius for 2k. Lock pick as well. Yeah, the rest. Headshot, human, same capacity, noise radius. No. Between one of these two. Do we pay 2k for that or do we go for these? Hmm. It's only nine, and this is creative in total. It's worth paying that much, actually, not for this. And we got the upgrade. Let's go. Okay, and where is Dabo? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna end this episode here, guys. I hope you all had a good time. I hope you were able to learn something. I'm gonna leave down in the description my Twitch, my socials, where I seem different here doing some other things. And as I said, please leave feedback, uh, your requests, what you think uh, was good, what was not bad, what was bad, what you want to see in uh, future episodes, videos, like any kind of uh, feedback or anything whatever you think guys do not hesitate please thank you for watching and make sure you use of this lunar event guys till next time peace guys